Hello students, now I am discussing here the topic which is very important that is alcohols. Now what are alcohols exactly? Alcohols are the hydroxy derivatives of alkane. That means what? From alkane one or more hydrogen atoms are replaced by hydroxy group that is OH group. Now see here alcohols are the hydroxy derivatives of alkane right now its classification classification it is depend on the hydroxy group attached so first monohydric alcohols now as name suggests mono is a single hydric is a OH group it means what in alkane one hydrogen atom is replaced by hydroxy groups so here CH3OH it means what methane CH4 from that one hydrogen atom is replaced by hydroxy group so that is CH3OH which is called as a methyl alcohol so this is monohydric alcohol second dihydric alcohols now what is dihydric again two hydroxy groups are attached See here, if we consider ethane, CH3 and CH3, one hydrogen atom is replaced by OH group, second hydrogen atom is replaced by second OH group. So this is dihydric alcohol. The example is ethylene glycol. Dihydric alcohols are also called as a glycols. So this is about dihydric alcohols. Now third we consider that is trihydric alcohols. Trihydric alcohols that is three hydroxy groups attached. Now see, if we consider again propane, CH3, CH2 and CH3. From that, one hydrogen atom is replaced by a hydroxy group. Second hydrogen atom is replaced by a second hydroxy group. And third hydrogen atom again is replaced by a hydroxy group. And this is the example. It is glycerol or in IUPAC, we can say one 2, 3, 3 carbons, so it is a propane, propane, 1, 2, 3, triol, why? Because 3 hydroxy groups are attached, so that is why it is called as a triol. Now, next one, polyhydroxy or polyhydric alcohols, here more than 3 hydroxy group attached, that is called as a polyhydric alcohols, it means See, suppose this is the example in which six hydrogen atoms of hexane replaced by six hydroxy groups. So that is CH2OH, CHOH, CHOH, CHOH and CHOH. Again there is a CH2OH. So six carbon atoms and six hydroxy groups. So it is hexahydric alcohol or it is nothing but the example sorbitol. So this is polyhydric alcohols. Now about monohydric alcohols, its classification. Monohydric alcohols can be further classified into primary alcohol, secondary alcohol and tertiary alcohol. Now it is again, it depends on the attachment of hydroxy groups to the carbon atom. Here hydroxy group attached to the first carbon atom of a chain either on this side or on this side this is called as a primary carbon atom so if hydroxy group attached to primary carbon that is called as primary alcohols so that is the example of propane one all here hydroxy group is attached to the primary carbon first carbon secondary alcohols that is second degree alcohols here hydroxy group is attached to the secondary carbon atom that is this is the secondary carbon atom of a propane CH3, CH and CH3 OH is attached to the second carbon atom so this is called as a secondary alcohols or second degree alcohols now third tertiary alcohols tertiary alcohols the hydroxy group attached to the tertiary carbon atom tertiary carbon atom what is tertiary carbon atom Central carbon has three CH3 groups are attached. 
सेंटर कार्बन आइटम हैज थ्री सी एच थ्रू ग्रुप एट अटैच दैट इज कॉल्ड टर्शरी कार्बन आइटम एंड वन ग्रुप इज अ हाइड्रोक्सी ग्रुप अल्कोहल ग्रुप सो टर्शरी टोटल कार्बन फोर ब्यूटाइल एंड हाइड्रोक्सी ग्रुप अटैच दैट इज अल्कोहल सो इट इज टर्शरी ब्यूटाइल अल्कोहल ओके नाउ सेकेंड टाइप ऑफ अल्कोहल दैट इज एलिविक अल्कोहल एलिविक इट मीन वॉट देर इज अ प्रेजेंस ऑफ डबल बॉन्ड so that is why called as allylic alcohols now again in this also there is a primary secondary and tertiary depending on the oh groups see here double bond is present so it is allylic alcohols now if we consider ch2 double bond ch ch2 and oh it means what there is the presence of a ch2 oh or hydroxy group attached to the primary carbon atom again so that is called as a first degree alcohol and it is double bond is also there it is example prop 2 in one all three carbon so it is prop after second there is a double bond so prop 2 in hydroxyl group it attached to the first carbon so it is prop 2 in one all second one this is secondary alcohol see oh is attached to the second carbon atom so this is secondary alcohol again total carbon four after third double bond so it is but three in and hydroxy group is attached to the second carbon so that is two all this is secondary alcohol now tertiary alcohol see carbon atom has three attachments of carbon and the hydroxy is attached so it is tertiary alcohol that is if we consider the numbering 1 2 3 4 After third, there is a double bond. So two methyl. Why? Because methyl group is attached to second carbon. Two methyl, three in total carbon four. So but and this is two all. So this is allylic alcohols. Now benzylic alcohols. Benzylic alcohol. It means what? There is a benzene ring present. Now see, if CH two is attached to the benzyl alcohol or benzene ring, it is first degree or benzyl alcohol. If CH OH is attached, called as the second degree or one phenyl ethanol. Here tertiary attached hydroxy group is also there, so it is numbering one, two, and three. So phenyl group is attached to the second carbon, two phenyl, three carbons, so propane. And again, OH is attached to the second position of carbon atom, so that is two all. So this is tertiary. Now, next one, vinylic alcohols. Vinylic is what? There is a vinyl group which is CH two double bond CH. This group is called as a vinyl group. If hydroxy group is attached to this group, it is called as a vinyl alcohol. So here, main Alcohols can be classified into monohydric, dihydric, trihydric, and polyhydric. Monohydric subclassified into primary, secondary, and tertiary alcohols. Next one, allylic alcohols and benzylic alcohols, and then finally it is vinyl alcohols. So this is about the classification of alcohols.